am Kathleen Hawkins, proud president and CEO of the Hendersonville Area Chamber of Commerce, and I am so excited to be here today with not only a, a member, but a friend, um, a leader in our community, and a great volunteer, because you've helped me out more than once, and I appreciate that. So um, Principal Cotter is here today, so please give us a warm welcome. Principal Cotter, thank you so much. Tell us where we're at and, and who, what room we're in. Tell us why we're here. All right, we are here at Hendersonville High School today, and uh, Miss Ball and Miss Brown sponsor our student council. And so today we have our student body officers uh, here to help us with uh, today's program. Okay, that is fantastic. Well, again, thank you so much for what everything you do for our community and for helping us out today. Um, we really, really respect you. You've even submitted some of the questions that some of these candidates are gonna get asked. So um, nice. again, yeah, nice. They're, they're <laughs> saying nice. No, it's okay. They were easy questions. They were good questions. Um, okay, so what we're gonna do today is we are going to film who is going to speak first in each one of the um, segments that we're gonna do. So we have two separate segments. One segment is Tuesday, and that's the mayoral forum. Um, that's October 6th, and it will be available at, at a luncheon as well as live stream. And then on October 13th, we are doing a Coffee and Conversations Day where candidates will get to meet all of the people um, that, or, or, or the community will get to meet all of the candidates that are running and hear from them personally. And then on October 22nd, we're going to have an Alderman Forum. So if you don't know who's running, now it's time to get out there and vote and get to know your, your candidates, and we're going to help you make that happen. Actually, they're going to help you make that happen. So tell everybody who you are. I'm Kate Agee. I am HHS student body president. Woohoo! That's fantastic. Thank you so much for your leadership. And you are going to tell us who's competing and who's going to go first in Ward 1. Is that correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so let's make that happen. So we've got Casey Smith and Mark Skidmore running for Ward 1. Speaking first will be Mark Skidmore. And speaking second will be Casey Smith. Okay, did you hear that? So Mark Skidmore is speaking first for Ward 1. Casey Smith that is also a candidate, and she's going to be speaking second. Thank you so very much. I appreciate it. And we'll hear from you again, I believe. So hang tight for just a moment. Okay, and next we have, can you tell us a little bit about who you are? I'm Graham Charlton, and I am the student body uh, vice president at HHS. Okay. Well, if you were any taller, I, don't, I think I'd need a step ladder to get to you. So thank you again for your leadership and for your help here today. And you're going to be helping us select who's going first for Ward 2. So tell us who you have. We have Lee Peterson and Scott Sprouse. Okay. So they're both going in. And he brought this prop, by the way. So <laughs> thank you. Great, great props to you. Yes, thank you. Talking first will be Scott Sprouse. Talking second will be Lee Peterson. Okay, good job. Thank you so much for your leadership. We appreciate your help today. Okay, and next we have who's speaking first for Ward 3? Hmm, I bet you it might be Russ Edwards. Russ Edwards is currently running unopposed. So, Russ, you are going to be speaking first and last for Ward 3. So, thank you so much for being here today and thank you for your leadership. Tell us who you are and what role you play. I'm Tyler Morris. I'm the student body treasurer of HHS. Okay, a man that likes to keep track of the money. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so you're back. All right, for award four, Andrew Bolt and Karen Dixon. Okay. Andrew Bolt will be speaking first and Karen Dixon will be speaking second. Okay, good job. Thank you so much. For Ward 5, we have Craig Garten and Rachel Collins. Trust me, Principal Cotter's mixing those up really good over there. Yes. First speaking, we will have Rachel Collins. Second, we have Craig Garten. Okay. Thank you. And almost last. It's Ward 6. We have Jim Waters, Matt Stamper, and Casey Cummins. Speaking first will be 
Kate, Casey Cummings. Speaking second will be Matt Stamper. And lastly will be Jim Waters. Okay, thank you. See, you went from Russ Edwards with one to three. That's how, it, that's how we roll here to keep everything fair. Everything we do is going to be fair and equal because we want everybody to be represented well. Okay, so now this, is this a big one? Okay, so this is a big one. So we have two candidates that are running for leadership, similar to the president, like you, just like you. <laughs> they are running for leadership. So tell us who our candidates are. We've got Jamie Clary and Brenda Payne. Okay. So mayoral candidate Jamie Perry and uh, or Mayor Jamie Clary and mayoral candidate Brenda Payne. All right. Speaking first will be Brenda Payne and second is Jamie Clary. Okay, fantastic. Thank you again so much for your help, for your service. Um, best of luck in all you do and know that the Chamber's here to support you. If we can ever be of service, just let us know. So we look forward to seeing you and streaming with you live. Please make sure that you tune in on October 6th, October 13th, and October 22nd. But most important, make sure you get out there and vote. Have a great day.